Before moving to the next agenda item, I would like to give the floor for any comments regarding adoption of the ministerial declaration and roadmap. I do not see any request for the floor. Uh, and uh, now we move on the two agenda item five. Any other matters? I invite any delegation with any matters for consideration by this meeting under this item to indicate in the chat. As I understand, the delegation of Armenia requesting for the floor. Please. Thank you, Mr. Chair, Mr. Minister. Uh, I would like to first thank you for holding this ministerial meeting today, and I'm sure I speak on behalf of uh, many New York-based colleagues in commanding the chairmanship of Kazakhstan and the leadership of our colleague, Ambassador Kaitbaya Kumarov, in steering the activities of the group. Uh, I'm taking the floor to make a brief comment on the adoption of the ministerial declaration, which I think can be helpful for our collective reflections on the work of the group and the way forward. I'm compelled to express strongest concern about the ways in which one delegation demonstrated a most distasteful and dysfunctional pattern of thought and behavior in course of negotiations on the text, holding hostage the inclusions of such important elements in the text of draft declaration as provisions on negative impact of, of unilateral coercive measures and references to necessity of maintaining transit freight transportation for the countries in disadvantaged geographical situation. Azerbaijan's complete inability to positively engage and contribute constructively in deliberations without irrelevant, highly demagogical narratives is detrimental to the interests of the land of developing countries and the agenda that the group stands for. The inflammatory rhetoric we heard today from the foreign minister of that country must be acknowledged for what it is, domestically driven propaganda and nothing short of instigation of hatred. This was an irresponsible, unhelpful distraction in complete disregard of the core interests of the group. I think we need to formulate better rules of engagement for the membership of the group so as to make sure that a single country is strictly restrained from hijacking the important collective agenda in front of us. Thank you, Mr. Chair.